Ganabelt must be somewhere inside. How about it, Law? Any idea which way it is? This is a Renan castle. You think they were in the habit of letting a Danon like me inside? Point taken. The astral energy's off the scale. Almost like it's pressing down on me. You can feel it? The whole castle must be brimming with it. My hunch is it'll get stronger the deeper we go. It must be the spirit vessel. You can bet anything it's pulsing with stored astral energy. We can't let Ganabelt use it against us. Then we can assume that's his plan A. <laughs> let him try. I'll destroy anything he throws at us. Like this should be easy.
Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. This place looks completely different from Balsif's castle. Every lord has their tastes. Whether this really suits Renan's sensibilities is another matter altogether. It's us Danans who built the structure, you know. How would we know what Renan's like? Who cares? Let's hurry up and get to the top floor so we can kick Danabelt's ass. to me. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
There's always room for improvement. What is this place? Some kind of armory? Looks like they're more for decorative purposes than actual combat. Does it matter? We've got a job to do. Wait, this isn't Renan. It's... Danon. Really? And not just this one either. All of these. It's all Danon gear. What's Danon equipment doing on display inside a Renan castle? Ask around later if you're so interested. But for now, we've got more pressing matters to attend to, remember? This open the door? We still don't know how to activate the elevator. We'll just have to see what we can figure out. That bastard. Giving us the run around. like we want it. They keep a Zugal locked up down here? Why? I've heard rumors that they feed prisoners to one instead of executing them. Do you think... Stop it! Move. I'm right behind you, Shion. Should we really take this? Way. 
way. Dance the I'm on Not on my watch. That's enough. These ones can run rings around us. I'm on Roach is One more. Not today. Now. Anything in normal. Astral energy. Full throttle. Rising water. I'm on Do it. Take this. Spread. Nicely done. Does this look like an elevator key to you guys? Only one way to find out. Let's go. Still thinking about that armory with all the Danon equipment? Yeah, especially that black armor. I don't think I've ever seen anything from Dana that looked so nice. I can tell you that it was definitely Danon. It was made using techniques found only here. That's how I know. But ever since the Renans came, our civilization's been scrubbed out bit by bit. Hardly anything's left now. Which is why most people don't remember. But why would the Renans have something like that? Unless it was the spoils of war. It must be a token of the Danans who fought and lost in the past. Or rather, that the Renans were able to beat them. Armor that nice must have been worn by a commander of some sort. They might have even been a Danan hero. A hero, huh? A fallen hero, maybe. I hate to see all that stuff fall into Ren in hands, but it's amazing to see that so much of it has survived. You into this kind of stuff then, Renwell? Uh, I mean, yeah, I guess. Are we done here? We don't want to keep Ganabelt waiting any longer. I'm right behind you, Shion. for the next battle.
Any injuries? This looks nice and tough. about right to me. Great. Now we can keep moving. Don't overdo it, Ma. What's this thing? Now you see what I can do! 
Onward and upward. You think the elevator's activated now? Should be. Let's check and find out. We're coming for you, Janabelt! Guys, what's up? We need to talk about Ganabelt. This guy can control both light and lightning, and I've heard his swordsmanship is unrivaled. I'm not surprised. He is one of the top lords, after all. That's not all. He also has these weird little gadgets that he likes to use. Gadgets? You mean like some kind of a Renin weapon? Probably. He's got a bunch of these things that hover all around him. They're supposed to protect him from attacks coming in at any angle. I take it there aren't any blind spots, then? Nope. 
Which is why I plan to bust down his defenses from the front. What? Why? Isn't that where his defense will be the toughest? That's why it's worth attacking. Once I poke a hole in that bastard's defenses, the rest of you can tear it wide open and give him hell! All right. We go with your plan, Law. Now let's get going. It's about time we got revenge for Zephyr.